Hi. Hi. Are you sure this course is just for two four nine nine? Yes, and you know this is the only course with this expertise across the world. No way. Yes way. Don't delay. Enroll now. Hello guys and welcome back to this amazing channel Geeks for Geeks. Today we are back with the next problem of the day which is number of good components. So it's a problem of graphs <clears throat> which is basically uh, based on the connected components logic okay concept and we have to basically count number of good components. So good components kya hote hain what are they? Uh, we will discuss. So first of all please uh, Uh, confirm that if I'm clearly audible and visible to you all, and then we will start. Okay. Am I clearly audible and visible? Okay, great. Hi, Rishit. Hi, hi, everyone. So the problem is number of good components. So the thing is that we are given with a undirected graph with the vertices, and you have to count number of good components. What are good components? good components are those where every two nodes or every two vertex has an edge or we can say every two vertex is connected every two vertex is connected hi what's so hi <clears throat> so basically <clears throat> let's say if we have a components of three nodes <clears throat> or three vertices so they all connected with each other they all should be connected with each other if we have four vertices then they all should be connected with each other if we have two so it's like this if we have one it's like this is it clear ki what is a good component like these are separate components can we know do you know now what is a good component these are the good components or we can say complete graph something which is complete graph is called good component theek hai you can see this is a there is only one good component in this graph so output is one here we have two good components like this and this is good this is not good no worry na guys to solve b problem simple let's one simple topics are required for b simply greedy or sorting searching is samana chahiye okay so this is there is the problem clear guys i hope problems will be clear like previously also Okay. Is the problem clear? At least respond. Keep order good components. Simply have to find number of good components. Simply have to count the number of good components. Okay, how many good components are there? Okay. Now let's see. <clears throat> let's say that these are some good components here. So let's take this thing. हमें count करना है कि how many like these are this is a graph, okay? So अच्छा <coughs> we have a we have a very famous problem in graph. Count number of components. So कितने components हैं इसे हम लोग कैसे form करें बताओ? Anyone? How we can find number of country components? कि कितने components? Like here we have three components. First, second and third. No, not cycle neck. I have explained. Between every two vertex there should be a edge between every two vertex there should be a edge that was a good component so guys dfs algorithm is used dfs algorithm is used to calculate number of connected components so har component ke liye what we do is we use dfs algorithm dfs algorithm and for each component we will exactly <clears throat> exactly this is and for each component what we will do 
we will count number of vertices and we will count number of edges exactly exactly and guys if if acha batao agar n vertices hai so how many edges should be there agar n vertices hai to kitni edges honi chahiye let's say there are n vertices so how many edges should be there एन एन माइनस वन बाय टू नॉट एन बाय अच्छा अगर अगर चार हैं सो ये भी तो होंगी इट्स एन इन टू एन माइनस वन बाय टू बिटवीन एवरी टू नोट देर शुड बी एच बिटवीन एवरी टू नोट देर शुड बी एच गेटिंग नॉट जस्ट द मेन नोट Between every two node, there should be an edge. Getting or not? Exactly n natural sum. Okay, n natural sum is n into n plus one. It's not n into n plus one. It's n c two exactly. It's n c two. Okay. So first of all, guys, I will simply write a DFS record. I will write a very simple DFS. Okay. So I hope DFS सबको आता होगा I I'm assuming this thing okay because like that's the prerequisite for uh, uh, this graph problem. So at least graph uh, guys अगर आपने graph नहीं पढ़ाया तो please आप DFS और BFS तो पढ़ी लो at least. Mostly graph problems are done using DFS and BFS okay. Lachman don't think how to take five to this five star to this four star just keep practicing practicing it 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 takes a lot of time. it may be it will take one year okay here i will I have a answer that will be zero answer means number of good components okay that will be zero it's fine now what i will do is now what i will do i will take a visited array or a visited vector that we do in that we have in of size v plus 1 so isko main n maan leta hu acha v maan leta hu v plus 1 so visitor means ki how many like which i hope everyone knows about uh, visitor okay like it's a simple dfs thing now for every node for every node from i think it's one base na okay so numbers are from 1 to v so hum log 1 se jayenge but Consider adjacency list from index one. So list को भी हमें index one से ही consider करना है. Okay, so means I will start my loop from one only. I think so. Yeah, I will start my loop from one only. ठीक है. So what I will do is I will start from one. We'll go up to v i plus plus. Now if that is not visited. If that node is not visited, and I'm simply writing the DFS algorithm, simply DFS, okay? So if that node is not visited, I will call DFS for that particular node. DFS, what do we pass? We simply first pass this adjacency list. We'll pass this A D J. We'll pass this V number of nodes, and we will pass the visited array. Okay. अभी के लिए मैं पास करती हूँ, okay? Now what I will do is, now what I will do is. I will write a DFS algorithm. White DFS, okay? It will have these three things like the ये दोनों चीजें तो होंगी होंगी, and along with that it will have this vector also, this visited vector, and always take the reference, okay? Oh yeah, exactly. We have to also pass I. Exactly. Now, exactly that's it. Okay, yeah. Now what we do is, that first of all I will make the visited of this i is equal to true or one. Then I will make its true on. Okay. Now for every adjacent of that i, for every adjacent of that i, I will have a. So for every adjacent node of that i, using this adjacency matrix, I will. Call this DFS. So the same DFS will be called. The same DFS will be called. 
ओके लक्ष्मण आई विल आई विल क्रिएट अ वीडियो आई विल क्रिएट अ वीडियो नो वरीज ओके दिस विल बी द थिंग ओके अच्छा ये भी चेक करेंगे कि इट शुड नॉट बी विजिटेड ऑल्सो विल चेक कि दैट शुड नॉट बी विजिटेड ओके विल चेक कि दिस वी टी आई टी दैट वर टेकिंग इट शुड नॉट बी विजिटेड ऑल्सो वो विजिटेड भी नहीं होना चाहिए ओके सो हेर आई विटन द सिंपल डी एफ एस एल गोट बट वॉट वी हैव टू डूज वी हैव टू फाइंड कि विच आर द गुड कंपोनेंट सो फॉर गुड कंपोनेंट वॉट आई विल डू इज क्या आई विल टेक टू मोर थिंग्स आई विल टेक अ इंट एन एंड आई विल टेक इंट ई So n क्या है n is number of nodes or number of vertices e is number of edges and I will pass this n and e with this dfs and I will call them here in n and e now whenever I will pass this so n will be increased by one why कि ये एक extra n आया in that component कि in that component this n is have it. is this that n is taken उस कंपोनेंट में ये एन आया एंड एजेस कितनी होंगी एजेस विल बी इक्वल टू द नंबर ऑफ एजेस कनेक्टेड टू दैट कंपोनेंट और कनेक्टेड टू दैट एज सॉरी एन प्लस प्लस मींस कि आ न्यू नोड इज टेकन नाउ हाउ मेनी एजेस आर कनेक्टेड टू दैट नोड वो कैसे पता करेंगे यूजिंग द साइज ऑफ दिस एडजेसेंट लिस्ट इफ आई विल ऐड दिस साइज ऑफ द एडजेसेंट लिस्ट इट विल टेल अस द नंबर ऑफ कनेक्टेड और द नंबर ऑफ edges connected with that node and that will pass here also and when this dfs call will be made iske baad we will check ki if e is equal equal to n into n minus 1 by 2 or not and if it is make answer plus plus acha ek cheez aur bhi hogi ki basically when we will find to e jo hongi that will be double okay Two times, ठीक है. Why two times? Because this four will also consider this edge. This three will also consider this edge. Four will also consider it. Three also consider. So we will divide e by two. Yeah, we can. Yeah, exactly. We can increment e in inside this also. Okay, that's fine. And at the last, we will return this. If I will run this, it's giving fine for this case. Okay, it's wrong here. Uh, let me check what's wrong. Okay. Okay. क्या गलत हो रहा है What's wrong here, guys? Anyone who can tell me? Oh, sorry. Yeah, E and S will be reference. Okay, exactly. I think that will be wrong. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was like from my side. Exactly. Otherwise, it will overwrite the values. Fine, 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 fine. Okay. No, no, no. It is required. It is required. Yeah, it, it is a reference. Okay. So this is the thing, guys. Now, if we talk about a time complexity, so it's just something equal to the uh, DFS. So DFS ki hoti order of v plus e. So it's again order of v plus e is a time complexity, and space complexity is simply order of v because we are taking the visited array. Okay. So like the the problem was quite like easy because someone who knows DFS. For them the problem is easy because look <clears throat> there is a problem guys if you know count number of connected components so ये वही problem है instead of connected components it's good component and for good component we have to make a condition that's all so actually it's a very important like it's a very amazing problem I will use it while teaching okay from next time so it's amazing 
okay guys so that was the problem uh, <clears throat> this particular problem so yesterday's problem was also quite good today today was like a good problem i can say a good graph problem so for those who don't know graph guys please at least go through dfs and bfs algorithm they are very important okay and for those who know graph i uh, know dfs i think that for them this thing should be clear okay how the things were done okay great Okay, guys. Thank you very much for today's uh, for joining today's live. I hope it's clear. Okay, let's meet next weekend, next Saturday, Sunday with the next problem of the day. Till then, happy coding. Bye bye. Uh, do you know how to pass a variable? I don't know much about Python. What's uh, what's up? Sorry, I don't know much about Python. Okay, I guess thanks, guys. Thanks. Bye. Uh, happy coding. Jeevji, करलो हो जाएगा.